Hi, this is Heather with Keep It Simple Social Media. And in this quick video, I am going to show you how you can assign another manager, editor, or another role on your YouTube channel so you do not have to give away your password on your Google account. So what we're gonna do is I've opened up my browser to Google. I'm gonna go over here to the right hand side and I'm gonna click on the nine little dots and from here, I'm going to choose my YouTube channel. Now, the reason I'm doing this is I have several clients that I put YouTube videos up for them. And you will see the most things that I look at are um, showing up first, which are videos. I love watching videos myself, singing videos. Now, from here, what I want you to do is go back over to the right-hand side where you see the circle. That is your logo. You're going to click on here. And from here, you can go to your channel if you would like to. Hi, my name's or you could click on the circle and go to the YouTube studio. So we really want to be in the YouTube studio. We're gonna click on YouTube studio. And now what I want you to do is look over on the left-hand side and scroll down the bar all the way to the bottom to where it says settings. Go ahead and click on settings. And now from here, we're gonna look at permissions. Go ahead and click on permissions. And it is in here that you have the new interface where you can add someone else as a role on your YouTube channel. Now this will not allow them to delete your channel, but it will allow them to add content and other things to your YouTube channel by simply clicking on the invite button now you're going to have to know their email address. And in my case, um, Susan, Debbie, Richard, it is going to be keep it simple social media at gmail.com. So it's K I S S O C I A L media at gmail.com. This is the account that I use to create content on my YouTube channel. And it is also the email that you need to add right here where it says email address for the user. And then you have to go one step further. You have to give access and select what you want that person to be able to do. So you can read each one and then decide what it is you would like the person who has now access to your YouTube channel, what you're allowing them to do. And in most cases, you're gonna let them be the manager of your channel or the editor. And then you just go ahead and click on that and make sure the email address is in there. Then you click done and then they will receive an email and if they accept it, they will then be able to add content to your YouTube channel freeing up time for you, as well as freeing up time when accounts get hacked or let's say you lose all your passwords. There's so many things that can happen today when it comes to social media. Just having these few safe extra steps is really helpful. And as well, you're not giving out your password to your Google account. So that's how simple it is today to add someone to be a manager of your YouTube channel. This is Heather, and let's remember, keep it simple.